Well, I've looked forward to this moment for quite some time. Um, I'm at a lake called Bush Farm, or a complex of lakes uh, called Bush Farm, near Upminster, in deepest, darkest Essex. And I promised my mate, I call him the big dog, but his name's Lee Hornsby, that when he opens his first lake, I would be here um, to see the stocking and everything else. So here I am, you've got VS Fisheries about to put some of their most glorious stock to go into a couple of the lakes here. Um, I'm really excited. I've actually never seen this happen before. I've never been somewhere where they've stocked carp, so it's a first time for me as well. Um, so we're gonna show you around the complex, show you some of the belters going in here, a new lake, a new complex coming to Essex. We've got 30 fish here today, Ali, and we've got some more to come a little bit later in the year on the harvest. And um, so what we'll do, we'll weigh them individually for the guys. All right? um, then we'll take photos and we'll slip them into their new home and job done. And that's a real absolute pearl of this one. Beautiful. That's one of our Harrow Crosses, right. um, which very historic bloodline from the Colne Valley, which we were lucky enough to spawn a few years ago. And now we're stocking them out into loads of fisheries around the UK. So this one's coming out of the tank next. I, there's just something about it, lovely scale pattern. All right, and yeah, very special fish for the future, I think. Well, that is about as pretty as a carp can get. Look at that, what a perler. With what Lee and the guys are doing here, they're creating a very good habitat, right? and that's, um, that's important really, and the fish should thrive here. Right? They're managing the stocks in the day ticket fishery, they're removing quite a number of fish, so the fish that they're leaving in there, plus the new fish that are coming in, they've got a far better home than they did when before they yeah. took over so the potential right, is, is very good here like yeah. I said it's it's a work in progress and any fishery like the work never ends you're always doing something each year just to make it a little bit better change things in terms of maybe the stock or the swims or stuff like that but um, it's got it's got a good potential here and I think as a little syndicate the shape of this lake is going to be Oh, that's, it was a real challenge. The, the rattlesnake yeah. lake, yeah. It is, it's a, yeah. It's, it's, I, I was shocked when unique, I walked around yeah. it. Yeah, very mm. di very different looking. And then yeah. obviously the, the day ticket is perfect shape. Nice rectangle. Yeah, yeah absolutely. I'd say the fish in there, like, they, they're going to be like, relatively easy to catch. Right? So it's going to be a great fun lake um, for the members. Even I like, might catch one. You might do, Ali. I've child. heard you've, you're pretty good. I I'm think, not right? sure. Yeah, so, no, it is actually all hype. <laughs> <laughs> but no, it, I suppose from your angle, from you and Scotty's angle, mm. it's much nicer to see your fish going into somewhere where you know they're going to probably get looked after. Absolutely. They're not right, going to yeah. get hammered um, and there's going to be sort of in, in 10 years time, you're gonna see them popping out well, at 40 pounds. Yeah, and you're gonna and that's, be proud. It's like we've, we've invested a lot of our lives into these fish. Like these fish have been with us for four and a half years and we're very lucky, Ali. We've got some, we've got great customers in general, like Lee and, and the team here at Bush and um, all over the country. And yeah, seeing them going into the right homes. And I suppose when we retire, like me and Scotty, when we're crippled with arthritis, bad backs, yeah. we're nearly there now, but um, we can sit down and look at fish that we've stocked now, right, in the early 2000s, right, uh, mid-teens, and um, 20 years' time, their 30s, 40s, 50s, right. What a feeling that will be, Ali. It and that's, that's the buzz we get from this, right, and, 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 and seeing and it, fisheries all over the country. Absolutely, right. and it'll always have a wonderful ring to it, won't it, when Scotty, mm and Viv stuck their meat into Bush in Essex. Uh, something like that. I, I'm sure there's a headline there somewhere in the, for the Daily Sport, I think, Ali. Like, definitely. All right. What a fish. Look at that. That's what uh, Scotty and Viv are famous for with their farming. These perlers. Well, here we go. A lovely 15 pound, two ounce one. And this is going in the day ticket lake. So they're uh, spreading the fish across both of them, the syndicate and the day ticket. But that is a real fat old carp. I'm gonna call you Sumo. Well, I said hello to you, stood next to the Syndicate Lake. I'm gonna say goodbye to you, stood next to the Day Ticket Lake. And actually, this is gonna be the one that's gonna be open first. So from March 2016, you're gonna be able to come to the Bush Farm Day Ticket Lake. It's gonna be run slightly differently. You're gonna actually become a member and then you can fish the Day Tickets. It's a way of actually keeping control of who comes on here, making sure that litter's not left, the fish are not damaged, and if you've seen the fish that have gone in here already, they're absolute perlers. You've had scaly ones go in, you've had some fat ones go in, they've been spread across both lakes on the complex, but the beauty about this day ticket lake is you're gonna have a real variety of fish to go for. There's loads of them in there, and there's even more to come from VS Fishery. So I'm really excited about this place. It's beautiful when something new opens near your home, um, run by your mates, can't wait to get going on here.